What up, babies and fans? This is Awesome and Cooler. Today we're gonna be do gonna be doing something completely different. I'm going to learn how to computer programming, and I've been doing this for the past few months. And from this is a wonderful site called Co Academy. Co Academy is a amazing site where you can learn computer program scripting languages such as jQuery, JavaScript, HTML, and H and CSS. The most thing interesting about it is that they give you like simple they do it by a step by step process like in, they get they instruct you like step by step like from the simplest like the sim like from beginning to finish and, and this I've been, and I love this website and lately I've been finishing my my I finished my web fundamentals and track and now I'm I'm still in, I'm into J, my JavaScript and jQuery and Python. So today I'm going to be doing starting my Ruby. Now, for those who don't know, for those who don't know Ruby or or what or what not what computer programming get the program the computer programming is computer programming is <coughs> is something that it you computer programming you're giving the computer instructions on what to do and computer programming is you can it's from databases to video to video game development to from video games to development to interactive and awesome websites like Facebook and what Ruby now in Ruby is one of those scripting languages there is much others but the big the big ones are JavaScript um, C++ C C Shark JavaScript, PHP, Python, and HTML and CSS and jQuery. I know that there's a bunch of other p computer programming languages. So, yeah, uh, what what is Ruby? Ruby is what Twitter uses, and it's the and it says right here, T Ruby is a very is a powerful yet beginner friendly language is used for professional web apps all over the world. So let's start our course. Introduction to Ruby. Overview and sneak peek. Ruby is a powerful, flexible programming language you can use in the web, internet development, to process text, to great games, and as part of the Ruby, the popular Ruby on Rails web frameworks, Ruby is high level, meaning reading and writing. Ruby is real easy, and it looks a lot like regular English. Interpreted, meaning you don't need a compiler to write and run Ruby. You can write it on here at Code Academy or even on your own computer. It may or ship with a with the Ruby interpreter built in. We'll be we'll get to the interpreter layer in this lesson. Object oriented, meaning it all it means it allows users to manipulate data structures called objects in the or to build and execute programs. We will learn more about objects later, but for now, all you need to know is everything in Ruby in an object is an object. <coughs> Easy to use. Ruby was designed by Yuriko Matsupenko, often called often just called Mats, in 1995. Mats set out. The to design a language that empathizes human needs over those of the computer, which is what why Ruby is so easy to, to pick up. This course assumes no previous knowledge of Ruby or in particular or programming slash or in computer science in general. Instructions ready to learn Ruby. Re ready to learn Ruby. Click the submit button to commit to continue, and I'll give the w the website below. And please like if you want me to learn like make not, make this as a like make this as a series, not a series. Hell no, not a series. No, I'll be just doing this to show you guys what I've been doing, than just making Minecraft videos. To be to be honest, it gets a little boring just recording Minecraft and all the video games. I want like I want to make my channel like different, and that's what you YouTube videos strive for. All right. <coughs> Let's get into the next lesson. Data types, numbers, strings, and booleans. In Ruby, your information or data com can come in different types. There are three data types in the Ruby that we are interested in right now. 
numbers, booleans which can be true or false. In strings, words, or phrases like I'm wearing ruby. Computer programs exist to quick analyze and manipulate data. For that reason, it's important for us to understand the different type the different data types and that we can use in our programs. Reminder never use quotation marks or what booleans or Ruby will think you're talking about a string, a word or phrase. Instead of a value that can be true or false. It it's also important to remember that Ruby is case sensitive. It cares about capitalization. Set the valuing variables to the corresponding values. My number my num which is my number to twenty five my booing to value true and the value of my string ruby there you go now the reason why I'm doing this is that I want to take time off of video game like making videos on video and gaming in general I want to make my diff channel different and get more audience so that, that's why I'm do really doing the computer like this computer programming stuff I might make a, a channel for it as well but not not right now maybe later or where maybe not maybe where I can make a channel for it anyways variables one of the most basic concepts in computer programming is the variable the variable you can think of a variable as a word or name that graphs a single value for example let's say you need the number 25 from our last example but you're not going to use it right away. You can set a variable say my num to grasp the value 25 and hang on to it or the layer use like this. My num equals 25. Declaring variables in Ruby is easy. You can just write out a name like my num using an equal sign to assign a, a value and you're done. If you need to change a variable, no sweat. Just type it again and hit equal to assign it a new variable. Instructions Set the variable my num to the value 100, then click the run button to run your code. Now, the, f the real in the, the interesting thing about computer programming, because this is, this is how YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, video games, databases, servers, and all of those things that you do on your computer are all come from in a field of computer science or computer programming. It's interesting how our world, how we need how we use our technology in our in our everyday lives. And if you don't know if you noticed I'm not using my usual career, usual recorder fraps. I'm using Bandit can't right now because it's better for me to use. Hold oh, on, Fraps, what are you doing there? Get out! Get out! Ruby isn't limited to simple expression. The math. Who? I hate math, but I'm so good at. It. <laughs> Ruby isn't limited to simple. Exp expressions of an assignment like my num equals 100 it can also it can also do all of the math you learned about in school there are six arithmetic operators we're going to focus on addition subtraction the addition plus subtraction minus multiplication times division slash exponent exponent the exponentation Uh, times times Mundulo percentage the only ones that probably look weird to you are ex expon the exponentation and Mundulo exponentation raises one number the base to the power of the other the exponent for example 2 